Hey everybody, the Bong is here and welcome to yet another taste test video where I try out different foods for the first time. And yes, I am doing like eating videos on a gameplay channel because I can upload whatever I want. And you guys are been showing me a lot of support over the week since I've done it. Since I like to branch out my content, well, I figure it would be a good time to do so because gaming is not going to be around forever, sadly. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. What is here and there is Presence Choice Winter Edition Tea. It's chocolatey peppermint herbal tea. I've had peppermint tea before. It's really good. The question here is, does chocolate work with tea? Chocolate or peppermint works well with hot chocolate, but with tea? Well, we're about to find out. So I brewed myself a cup. I just let it steep for around four or five minutes. So I find if you steep it for too long, it starts to get bitter. Also, it's a good idea to make sure your boiling hot water cools down for maybe a minute. And then you put your tea leaf in. Because too hot a water actually doesn't help it either. Well, hopefully I can be able to take a sip without burning my tongue. Speaking of burning my tongue, don't worry, noodles are still coming later on this weekend. So, let's take a sip. See, you can smell a little bit of the chocolate with the tea bag itself before you boil it. And if you're actually smelling the tea bag, it almost smells like an after eight bar, which is really good. I could taste a little bit of peppermint, like it starts to linger on your tongue for like a few seconds. I don't really notice the chocolate. Like chocolate, it's good for hot chocolate or cocoa, but not necessarily for tea. It's kind of just out there. You don't notice it much. Like, it is refreshing. It's definitely great for the winter season. Or if you ever just need to relax with it. But it's good as a peppermint tea. Like, I don't, I don't feel like it needs the chocolate that much. In my opinion. So I guess out of like a scale of one, a scale of one to five, I'd probably give it a, a three and a half. Like, it's still good. But does the chocolate ever make an impact on it? Not really. Like, just do it as peppermint, and I'm good with that. Then it could have been up to a four. Or even, like, maybe candy cane flavor tea? Would that work? I I'm not someone that actually makes tea, so I cannot answer that. But anyway, I guess I'll see you guys for the next video. Bye.